2023 marks the 32nd year at the Owl Research Institute's Snowy Owl Project. Although every year isn't a breeding year for the snowy owls at ORI's study site, we still have plenty of work to do in the field. 2023 is one of those non-breeding years for the owls in Utkagvik, Alaska. However, finding and monitoring nests isn't the only thing ORI works on up in the Arctic. Here's what our field crew keeps busy with on the tundra. Throughout the season, our crew thoroughly checks and rechecks the 100 square mile study area for any owl nests, both hiking on foot and riding the ATV around the tundra. We ensure the full study area is checked three times to prevent missing any extra hidden or late nests. As learned from Denver Holt, we also make sure to get in our tundra naps. Aside from nest searching, we also conduct three rounds of lemming surveys to monitor the lemming population. This gives us a good idea of the prey availability on the tundra, which tends to correlate with the number of snowy owl nesting pairs. Without enough lemmings, the owls are less likely to attempt to raise a nest full of hungry chicks. Much of our time is spent collecting behavioral data at the roost sites of non-breeding snowy owls. Owls are located roosting on and around the high-centered polygons on the tundra. At the roost site, we collect data such as the flushing distance of the owl, temperature, wind speed, cloud cover, and the relative position of the owl to the sun and wind. On top of our surveying and data collection, we are always trying to learn more about the flora, fauna, and geography of the tundra, collecting samples, reading books, and documenting our findings in an effort to understand the full ecosystem of the tundra. When not in the field, the crew repairs equipment, enters data, and enjoys their time in town exploring the Inupiat Heritage Center, visiting the library, running errands, and cooking at the field house. Annual tradition dictates that the crew must complete a polar plunge in the Arctic Ocean to cap off the end of a great Arctic field season. Nests or not, the Owl Research Institute has work to do.